G'day guys, how are you? Now today I'm going to show you how you can install a Super Nintendo emulator uh, onto Ubuntu 14.04 LTS and I'm also going to show you how you can get a controller to work because playing a Super Nintendo emulator without some sort of controller is kind of boring I think unless you're like PC gamer hardcore then go for it but I don't really like it uh, if I can use a controller I will use a controller so and in the game that is okay so let's begin we're going to open up our terminal press control alt if you wish which is the shortcut for it, which is to get type in sudo app dash get install and we want to install the controller system first pop in, uh, pop in this. I'll leave the um, description in I'll leave the command in the description <coughs> ok you want to press y if no I don't have to then you want to type in sudo app dash get install z uh, is it z s m e s that. You will have to press one except it, that I have managed to so that doesn't have to find out so you like that. Great, once that's done, type in sudo app dash get update. Just so we don't leave no loose strings behind because sometimes it can happen you want to lose your family operating system. It does things when it wants to. And it doesn't do things when it doesn't want to. You know what I'm saying? Now just for peace sake, you can press up and go upgrade, you don't have to do this, but it's best to do it just in case, let's see the take it on. Great, we're nearly there. Now we're going to press on the search here and we're going to find the joystick, let's pop in this, J-O, and there it is there, we're going to open it. See it's got nothing there. Now what we're going to do is we're going to plug in the USB into the USB port, that's where it belongs, and we're going to press refresh. And then we go found it says we've got 10 buttons and two access to the parts. Great, so just minimize that, do not turn it off. I repeat, do not turn it off. I suspect that you guys know how to get the ROMs, so just let me do that to it. Then we're gonna press config and uh I'm gonna, that one. I'm gonna go to input and we're gonna go to set the keys. So it says here we're gonna press up, down, left, right. Start to it. Let's add anything. And obviously, this one can be my A, this can be my B, this can be my X, and this can be my Y. Left button, right button, bang, finito. Finished. Awesome. So, I suspect you guys know how to get a ROM to work. You just go to In Your Paradise, Super Nintendo Systems, and select one, follow the captions, and whatever. Now, we're going to go to game, we're going to load the game. So, let's select where we're going to load it from. Uh, and let's get in my directory, this is in my desktop. There it is, and we press load. And it's loading! Oh, cool. That's him! Super, 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 super! Let's go down, slow down, slow down, and press start. Oh, yeah, it's working, look at that. Yeah, it's working. Yes, spawn player. I don't want to go here. Alright, panic. There he is, old Diddy. Let's go on that one. Oh, there he is. Let's go around next to old Diddy. Next to old Diddy, let's go get me. And there we have it. You can make it full screen if you want. Oh, you're kidding me. Yeah, he's nice. Haha. Uh -huh. Yeah. I'm going to swing down and down from this dude at the checkpoint. Throw it in there. What? No, no, just. I feel odd. But, anyways, that's how you get um, a Super Nintendo emulator to work on Ubuntu. If you have any questions, please leave them down below. And like always, please comment, subscribe for more videos. I would really love to see some support um, and get this channel up and going. Thank you. Bye bye.